हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू अल आई एम चंदन पवन प्रधान वेलकम टू यूट यूट्यूब चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टाइम इंडिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन लेट्स बिगेन प्रीवियसली वी डिस्कस्ड ऑल द कंसेप्ट रिगार्डिंग टाइम डिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन बट हियर वी हैव टू गेट द टाइम इंडिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन फ्रॉम दैट ऑफ टाइम डिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन सो द टाइम डिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन वॉज आई एच क्रॉस डेल साय साय एज ए फंक्शन ऑफ आर एंड टी डेल साय बाय डेल टी इज इक्वल टू माइनस एच क्रॉस स्क्वायर डिवाइडेड बाय टू एम ग्राड स्क्वायर साय आर टी प्लस भी आर टी साय आर टी दैट इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन दिस इज द टाइम डिपेंडेंट स्क्रोडिंजर इक्वेशन देर विल बी टाइम फैक्टर द डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इट इज ए सेकेंड ऑर पार्सल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इट इज ए सेकेंड ऑर्डर पार्सियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन एंड इट्स सल्यूशन इट्स सल्यूशन इज साय आर टी हुईज इज ए फंक्शन ऑफ आर एंड टी which is a function of r and t now our aim is to establish the time independent schrodinger equation by using the time dependent schrodinger equation so our aim is uh, to establish the time independent schrodinger equation as psi rt as psi r another function let it treat f of t that equation number 2 now substituting that equation in equation number 1 substituting the value of psi at t substituting this in equation one we get just put psi at t as psi r f of t since it is a function of t it will be differentiated with respect to t but another term r t is constant therefore psi r आई एच क्रॉस डेल एफ टी डेल टी इज इक्वल टू अगेन हियर एफ एफ टी टू दैट आउटसाइड एज कॉमन इन बोथ 
two terms inside that of bracket minus h cross square divided by two m grad square psi r plus b r psi r. That is equation number three. Now dividing both sides by psi r f of t. Dividing both sides by psi r f of t, we get i h cross by f of t del f of t by del t is equal to 1 by psi r as common as we divide psi r f of t here inside that of bracket minus h cross square divided by 2 m grad square psi r plus b r psi r equation number 4 look that equation the lhs of that of equation that is the lhs of that of equation is the function of t only and the rhs of that of given equation is the function of r only therefore we can equate these two sides with a same constant let us write the lhs of this equation depends on t and independent on r independent on r the rhs the rhs depends on r and independent on t therefore since lhs depends on t and independent on r rhs depends on r and independent on t therefore we can equate therefore each must be equated must be equated to a constant which is independent of which is independent of r and t let us uh, denote that constant let us denote that constant e and uh, which is called and that is called the separation constant that is called the separation constant therefore that side is equate to a constant that is i h cross divided by f of t del f t divided by del t is equal to e and again that term that is 1 by psi r minus h cross square divided by 2 m grad square psi r plus b r psi r equate to that of same constant e prefer it as equation number 5 this as equation number 6 from equation 5 
from equation 5 we have i h cross del f t by del t is equal to e into f of t since uh, this is the only variable t therefore the partial differentiation can be sense to exact differentiation ok that is written like this d f t d t is equal to that is e by i h cross f of t or d f of t by d t is equal to now multiplying i and dividing i in the numerator and denominator part i square h cross f of t or d f of t by d t is equal to minus i h cross sorry that is uh, 1 i square minus 1 that is minus i e divided by h cross into f of t when that to this side it will be d of f of t by d t plus i by h cross e f of t is equal to 0 that is equation number 7 look at that equation this is the faster linear and homogeneous differential equation this is the first order linear and homogeneous differential equation whose constant coefficient of its solution Since it is the faster linear and homogeneous differential equation, therefore its constant coefficient of its solution is whose constant differential equation with constant coefficient. Sorry, not that is differential equation with constant coefficient. So its solution is a form like f of t is equal to e to the power minus i by h cross e t that is the solution of this type of differential equation equation number 8 so this is the written form of that equation number 5 we get that equation from equation number 5 again from equation number 6 from equation 6 equation 6 can be written as in the form minus h cross square divided by 2m grad square psi r plus v r psi r is equal to e psi r or taking or multiplying negative sign on both sides h cross square divided by 2m grad square psi r minus v r psi r minus e psi r e psi r to that side it will be h cross square divided by 2 m grad square psi r plus e minus v r psi r is equal to 0 
that is equation number 9 that equation look at that equation is a second order partial differential equation and that it does not involve the factor t the equation 6 sorry equation 9 is a second order partial differential equation and uh, does not involved does not involved t and hence is called that is the time independent Schrodinger wave equation time independent since it will be no such term as time time independent Schrodinger equation in 3d hence that wave equation can be given as Hence, the wave function psi as a function of RT given by that is psi RT is equal to psi R f of t or psi RT psi R in place of f of t we can substitute e to the power minus i by h cross et e to the power minus i by h cross et equation number 10 so that is the time independent Schrodinger equation time independent means it does not depend upon time this independent time independent Schrodinger equation. So, with the help of this video lecture, we understand the time independent Schrodinger equation and it is derived from that of time dependent Schrodinger equation. We proceed like this, we get a equation where the LHS is depend upon T only that is not depend upon R and RHS is depend upon R only not T therefore we equate we equate the left hand side and right hand side to that of same constant let that same constant be E that is the separation constant we equate it now equation number 5 equate to that of constant and it will be changed to this this one is the first order linear and homogeneous differential equation with constant coefficient and that solution will be this and, then, and again that equation number 6 further written like this here there will be no such time factor involved therefore it is known as time independent Schrodinger equation in 3d and the wave function psi rt is written as this one so with this useful and informative notes let me wind up this session Thank you.